Today, I'm really excited. We got some Shadows of the Galaxy. We got a whole booster box of Star Wars Unlimited. This actually released a little bit ago. I'm just getting to the party a little bit late, and I apologize. Oh, yeah, my box is a little bit damaged, and that was totally on me just traveling with this box. So, uh, yeah, that was not on wherever I bought that. I don't even remember it, because now these go for less than retail. So, I'm pretty, I paid, like, retail, I'm pretty sure, for these at the time, because it was so long ago. But let's try and get a showcase. Let's check out some of the new cards i am literally so excited there i haven't seen a lot of them i've seen a few of them um some of the legendary uh, legendaries and uh showcase cards i mean kylo and ray that would be absolutely incredible i mean come on so we got cad bane a leader starting off that's so sick and we'll try and organize everything as well we got remnant science facility Another cool one with a little experience token on the back of Mando right there. We got Follower of the Way Common. Um, Death Watch Loyalist. Oh, that's pretty neat. We got Village Protectors. Modded Cohort. Ambush. When you play this, re Raid 2. Oh, okay, so I'm, still, I'm more of a collector when it comes to Unlimited. And, uh, oh, we got our first hyperspace cargo juggernaut. Why do I always feel like we get so many juggernaut hyperspaces? That's a pretty cool one, though. Starting off in pack one, I'll take that. We got Wanted right there. Slaver's Freighter. But, yeah, like I was saying, I'm a little bit more of a collector as of lately. I really want to play. I want to play so bad. I just don't really have anyone to play with. So I need to go to, like, a local event or something. We got Fennec Shand right there. Dang. Okay, I'm so excited to see some. I guess I saw Cad Bane as one of uh, the um, big uh, cards. I think that would be so. Kylo 2, legendary card right off the bat. Hey, yo, that seems pretty solid. That's pretty. Oh my god. Okay, and we got a foil, hyperspace, daring ray. This is just gorgeous artwork, too. I like that a lot. Deal two damage to a unit or a base. Pretty simple card. Well, you have to... Oh, there's so many categories when you're trying to organize these cards. That's for sure. You got the foils. You got the hyperspaces. You got so many different things. We got a Bosk hyperspace up next. That's a beautiful leader card as well. Where are we putting our hyperspaces? Okay, right here. Uh, Navarro City as our location. Um, Go, uh, Gamorian Retainer. And I also know that they've started releasing some of the next uh, set, like some of the cards for the next set, and Ahsoka's in it, and I am a huge Ahsoka collector. So we're going to go a little, I do have another box of the Shadow of the Galaxy, by the way, and who knows, like I said, they're under $100 right now, so they're pretty easily accessible and pretty easily affordable, less than retail. So I might get my hands on another one. Let's see. I really wanted to try and get a showcase in like every single set, but the rarity is just a little much for the price of the boxes right now. We got Sonara San on common card. A uh, Valiant Assault Ship. Some of these cards just score. Zuckus too. I love Zuckus. That's so cool. Uncommon, uh, Unrefusable Offer. And Forlom. Whoa. That, that just looks like really gorgeous with the detailing on the look at check that out this bordering right here oh my gosh it also like reflects i just think that that is such a wicked card okay continuing on now that i'm a little bit more organized in the background right there we'll see how long that stays up because i'm definitely gonna have to uh do that again i get out of control with some of these we got fennec shan a beautiful leader card that is pretty cool. Put it right there. Remote Village. Warzone Lieutenant. But like I was saying with the next set, I definitely want to get the Showcase Ahsoka card. So I might try and just go super, super hard. I'm going to be on. There's so many other Ahsoka cards related cards as well. I just wanted my collection as a collector. I would love to make a deck for that. And that's probably when I'm going to really start trying to play and commit to the game, to be honest. Once Ahsoka comes out, I'll be running an Ahsoka deck for sure. And that <laughs> that's my main, I guess. Hopefully she's, she's good. Okay, we got Cloud Rider. But yeah, I think I might even... Yeah, we'll see. We're going to do a lot. So stay tuned for that for sure. That's an uncommon right here. As um, Midnight Repairs. Arm to the T. Something looks shiny in the back right there. Tech. Oh my gosh. Tech is so cool. I saw there's like a Hunter or one of the Bad Batch characters got a showcase card. This is a nice one. Rare right there. Black Sun Starfighter. Just like, yeah, I love the card. It's a little dark. Like, it, it looks dark in person. That's just a really... I don't know. 
It, I mean, it looks cool with the reflection and stuff, but sometimes I wish some of these cards were a little bit brighter, but that is a gorgeous card, so I'll give them that for sure. We're going to continue on. Oh my gosh, this is going to be a long video. I'll try and open up a little bit faster. I'm just admiring some of this artwork. I mean, it is just gorgeous. Oh, that's what I'm talking Look at that bright green. That is sick. That's what I'm talking about. Boba Fett looks... That's such a sick card. We got Jabba's Palace up next. Oh yeah, there's a Jabba the Hut uh, showcase as well. Ruthless Assassin. Well, I guess all the leader cards. I mean, so I guess that makes sense. Moment of Glory. Like I said, I've only seen Tell of Amber's Grapple Shot. Detention Block Rescue. Uh, Vigilant Pursuit Craft. Oh, Hyperspace card. Take Captive. I mean, that artwork, again, just looks so sick. It looks almost like anime, to be honest. A friendly unit captures an enemy non-leader unit in the same arena. Wait, that seems solid. I mean, uh, yeah, I don't know the exact um, meta or anything like that, but we'll um, we'll take a gamble. I play a lot of Hearthstone. I hit Legend, you know, quite a bit. I played since, like, 2015. Marvel Snap's pretty fun, too. I gotta be honest. Spare the Target. But I love card games, anything like that. Always a big fan. Used to play Pokemon. Um, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Well, Yu-Gi-Oh! I didn't actually play. But Pokemon, I did play online when they had the online version. That was really fun. Dr. Pershing. Oh, my, this would be so cool, actually, to get signed by the actor. I've seen the actor at a few different things, and he doesn't have, like, pops or anything like that. Actually, I might get a card. I'm going to put this one aside for my personal. I would need to get, like, this um, hyperspace of that one, the public enemy. That would be really, really cool, actually. I like that idea a lot. And, yeah, again, the borders on this card just look so gorgeous. All right. Continuing on with that pack. I said I'm going to get faster. I'm, like, not at all. Okay, that's my fault, my fault. But come on. What the heck? This card was, like, stuck for a second. We got Kylo Ren. I want... Give me a... Give me one. Just give me one. That was a rare, by the way. Mascatana's Castle. Very nice location card. Take Captive. Okay, we got the normal version. That, again, that artwork looks great. I love the bright green. It looks so good. Uh, Trandoshian Hunters. Price on your head. Clan Ren Rescuer. Disabling Fang Fighter. I love the Lego Fang Fighter. Rivals Fall. Ma Clownkey. I don't know that character. I love learning. I'm going to look up that character later for sure. Love learning new characters. Gray Squadron, Y-Wing, Smuggler, Starfire. That's an awesome ship, by the way. Uncommon, Head Hunting, Mercenary Gunship, and Fen. Wow, wow. Uncommon, Hyperspace card. That's a nice one as well. We will take that Mandalorian card. I assume you played this with Bo-Katan. Her uh, ability was to... Um, something to do with Mandalorians, right? We got the... Oh, this is a legendary. Evacuate. Nice. So that's our second legendary. Pretty solid. Uh, return each... Oops. Return each non-leader unit to its owner's hand. Each non -leader. Oh. Um, okay. Yeah, I don't know if that's good or not. Seems pricey. Uh, scanning officer. But, yeah, again, I don't know the exact meta. Uh, uncommon. Nice little card right there. And, oh, my gosh. We got so many packs. Yeah, I didn't even say this at the beginning. We got 24 booster packs to go through. Now, that's why I think, like, for $100 or less, that's a pretty good deal, to be honest. Like, $4 a pack. We got a hyperspace leader right here. We got a Hondo. Yo, Hondo in this. This is, again, Jim Cummings would be an awesome autograph to get this signed. That is a gorgeous one. I love getting the leader hyperspace cards to first year. Spice Mines. Uh, common right there. Oh, wait, that's a location. Clone de Desert. Oh, my gosh. That is kind of deep. A deep card. That's a clone, too. Restore one when this unit attacks. Heal one damage from your base. Oh, that's like a sweet card if you actually like think about it. That's really cool. Reckless Gunslinger. All right. We Quay Pirate Band. We K Quiet Pirate Band. I'm also going to have to look up this group. Unsure about that origins. Rickety Quad Jumper. Heroic Renegade. Um, High Plobon, Forcer, God, some of these words, crazy, common, Twin, ooh, Twin Pod, Cloud Car, what, we gotta see this show up, oh my gosh, we gotta see that in live, a I need to see that in live action, Principled Outlaw, oh wait, that's a common card, oh my gosh, see, my stack's already getting a little bit out of hand, Frontier Trader, love that artwork, Emphy's Nest, love Emphy, underused character for sure, and underused actor, Jabba's Rancor Uncommon. That's cool. I love seeing any Rancor cards. I love Rancors. Who doesn't? All of them used to be OG. All the OG toys and stuff. Top Target Uncommon. And a rare... Oh, there's one more card. Arquentin's Assault Cruiser. Nice little rare right there. And Wanted Insurgents. 
as our little foil card right there. That's that's a pretty nice card. Again, it's just so dark, it's sometimes hard to tell. All right, making a little pile in the pack right there. Now at this time of day, the, at, when I'm filming this, my neighbor is actually playing his piano. I mean, sometimes you hear me say that, it's because he is so talented. I'm not kidding, I love when he plays. Dr. Afra. let's go. I, I would love the showcase of her. I know it's one of the cheaper ones as well, just a little bit over $100. All right, we got, I mean, that's so sick. That's a good one. Death Watch Hideout as well. Our first card, um, Cargo Juggernaut, or our first hyperspace one. Clone Deserter, again, that's such a sad card. Price on your head. And Village Protectors. Reckless Gunslinger. Oh, is this a reference to, oh, this is Mandalorian. Um, yeah, the Gunslinger episode, what is it, episode 5 of season 1, something like that? I'm not sure. Pillage, Common, Hyperspace Guard. That's a nice, cool little one. That's just, yeah, Gray Squadron, Y-Wing. Um, Ma, again, <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce that. Twin Pod Cloud Car, there we go again. Lady Proxima, so we're really starting to get some repeats now. Well, again, some of these uncommons, not Coruscant Descendant, that's a really cool card. You may ready your resource. Four Lom, Hyperspace Card, we'll take that. That is a cool one. Legal Authority as our rare. And a Desperado Free Rider. That's pretty, mm, you know, pretty standard base card. I mean, I guess we'll take that at the end of the day. We'll take anything at the end of the day. I just love getting as lucky as possible. And uh, so far, I'm not sure if I'm feeling the love. I love the artwork of this, but um, yeah, let's get lucky one time. What? How many boxes of this? Is total is this now that we've done? We should be getting our showcase very soon. <laughs> Hondo, just our normal one right there. Jabba's Palace. Beautiful location. Rickety Quad Jumper as our common. Weakway Pirate Gang. Heroic Renegade. Outland the Vanguard. Uh, the high. Oh, you hear him? So good. Let's be quiet for a sec. <laughs> okay, were you hearing him during that? I'm not even sure. Crosshair. Love seeing the Bad Batch representation. Unexpected escape. I know this is Bad Batch, um, Boba Fett, Han Solo, and like Mando cards, but that's why I'm so excited for the Ahsoka ones next time. Costco, Reeves, loves, again, another good autograph potential for her, but she does have like a Black Series figure and stuff that might be better. Cassie and Andor as our card, that is a cool one. I love seeing, Ca oh, okay, so I guess it's just a bunch of different shows. I mean, Shadows of the Galaxy, honestly, I do really think of Maul and Cad Bane, and we haven't really seen any of those guys or cards that like relate to them too much. I mean, they're the ones on the poster right there. Not com actually complaining. I'm just thinking out loud, I guess. <laughs> okay. We got Hunter as our uh, next leader card. Space Mines. Uh, Juju Hawk 290 Free Fighter. We got a lot of these little base Free Fighter cards. Interesting choice. Black Sun. So, see, that's a sick Starfighter. That, why can't we see these in live action? Reputable Hunter. Wanted Insurgents. Outlaw Corona, Nin, uh, Nima Outpost Constables, Common. Man, there's so many names in this that I'm actually unfamiliar with, and I feel like I have pretty solid Star Wars knowledge normally. Hunter of the Haxian Brute. It really gets when we get to these, yeah, literally the shadow parts. I guess I got to study more, read more uh, Legends books and stuff. <laughs> Lurking the Phantom Uncommon, Bounty Hunter's Query. The Client, beautiful card, and I don't know why I said that about Legends now that I think about it, because none of this is actually Legends. Zanadu Blood as our rare. That's such a sick ship as well, and that shot of the laser, that looks really, really good. We'll take that Criminal Muscle as our little foil card. Yeah, these foils are just so dark, and that's kind of like my main thoughts on them. Let's, we're, I doubt we're keeping this box, so let's pull some of these packs out. Put them at the top so it's a little bit easier. Okay, let's go. Three packs. Let's just hit these three out, and then we're halfway done. We're like 15 minutes in, something like that. Okay, Ray as our next hero card. Remote Village. Ooh, that's a nice one. The low Givian Anti. I reading that on the fly is not working for me. Found. Oh my gosh, what a great shot of Grogu when he's calling out. Love that. Adelphi Patrol Wing. COVID is okay. Now we're just being ridiculous. Okay, we're just gonna keep going. Let's look. Let's pull our showcase. Black Sun Starfighter. That's a sick hyperspace. Again, like I said, that car looks so good. The hyperspace on it. Uh, yeah, that's 
that's a nice that's a nice one for sure oh gosh all our cards are falling we'll fix that in a second we got frontier trader look the other way cassian and or once again freetown backup oh nice vembrance van brace flamethrower on the mando's arm attached to a non-vehicle unit unit gets on attack you may deal three damage wow that sounds good that sounds really good okay okay i see you evidence of the crime rare and a pre vizsla rare hyper wow with the dark saber to see i feel like this card looks so good with a little bit better lighting but again and the borders on this one look pretty solid too that's that's nice that is a nice one. Okay, wow, okay, once again, gonna try and rip these packs open real quick. Here we are going slow. I just can't stop appreciating some of this artwork and character choice. Garth's act, and also just like the theme of it and everything, it all just makes so much sense. And I, I'm so glad they did this little Shadows of the Galaxy set. They look wicked. House cast soldier. We got moisture farmer, timely intervention. Uh, Desperado Free Fighter, Warbird Stowaway. We got Super Commando Squad. That's actually pretty sick. I love the Super Commandos. Uh, no Bargain. Wow. What kind of. That's a common. What kind. Is this like a different type of card? This looks so different. I don't know why. Um, Liberated Slaves. Rich Reward. Fell the Dragon. Oh, that's pretty cool. Tangar. Uncom oh, that was an uncommon too. When they take down uh, the little jaw, uh, what's it called? Tuscan Raiders take down the stuff. Uncommon, or no, was it? Yeah, that was the Tuscan Raiders. Okay, uncommon. Mod Cantana L3. Oh god, I'm just out of order, and we hit a legendary hyperspace foil card, and it's, Ky it's Kylo's tie silencer. Are you kidding me? This actually is such an awesome pull. This is wicked. Oh, now we gotta get now we gotta get Kylo. We're making a Kylo deck, I guess, for this set. Oh my gosh, that is beautiful. When it comes to like borders and stuff like the actual damage card, yeah, this is this needs to see play. This can't be. Gotta put this one a little bit to the side. Let's do this last one, and then we are officially halfway done. And now I think that Kylo's tie silencer kind of just made this. If the unit was discarded from your hand or deck. Uh, Play it from your discard pile. Okay. Oh, yeah. Finn's in here as well. Death Watch Hideout. Nice. I love those ships. I love the way they land. And oh, so oh, that's a hyperspace too. Gotta put it with the hyperspace cards. Okay. Rokai Gunship. Covert Strength. Mercenary Company. Uh, Hut's Henchman. Pillage. Collector Starhopper. Uh, Privateer Sick. Resourceful Pursuers, Bounty Guild Initiate. Wow, yeah, these cards are just... I can't stop trying to look at it. Remnant Reserves, Uncommon. This is the way, Mando. Search the top big cards of your deck for up to two Mandalorian. And upgrade cards, reveal them, and draw them. That's powerful. That's specific. Concord Dawn Interceptors, Uncommon. Uh, Mig Migs, Migs Mayfield. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. I love seeing Migs. I love... Oh, yeah, okay, that's not... Sorry, I thought that was a shiny for a second. Collection, Starhopper, and that is our little refractor card, or whatever you want to call it. And that is literally half of the box so far. So we got the stack. We're just moving this box out of the way. It's damaged. I doubt I'll end up keeping that. Let's start opening up some of our last packs. I'm excited. Let's get this showcase. Come on. We actually deserve this now. Let's get into it, baby. We got Ray, and that's a showcase that, you know what? I gotta be honest. I would love to see. Okay, hold on. I gotta fix the uh, stuff right there. There we go. Ray right there. Jabba's Palace as our location. Oh, yeah. I should have. Yeah, I need to reorganize some of these. Foundling. Night Owl Skirmish. Moisture Farmer. Take Captive. Okay, now we're seeing the repeat comments. Hunting Nexu. Hunter of the Haxian Brew. That is such a sick looking art design. Oh my gosh. Hyperspace. Put you over there. Look the other way. Oops. Wait, we are not getting good focus. Of yeah, see? Look at that artwork. Pretty solid. Looks anime ish. Cartel Turncoat. We got Protector of the Throne. Forlom once again. We're seeing a lot of these little. I like seeing these bounty hunter guys. Scanning officer. Embo. Oh, nice. That's cool. I didn't know he was actually in this set. And then first light as our rare. 
and Super Commando Squad. Lower fra yeah, that's just looking so... I actually think the comment of that one might look almost a little bit better than that. I don't know. Let me know your thoughts on them. I, are the cards getting a little too dark for that? Why did it... Lacrana kind of does the same thing as well. We got Cad Ban here as our next leader card. Remote Village, Hyperspace. I mean, I think the location cards or base cards always oh god i've been calling it location it's literally base right there i don't know why i'm doing that i apologize if i accidentally call something you don't know, like i get it i make so many mistakes and this is my first time kind of like, okay pirate battle tank let's just get on with it that is such a sick design card though um super command squ commando squad we got clan challengers that's pretty cool ruthless assassin nice uh, Van, Van Brace Grapple, oh, that's a grapple shot, just a normal base card of it. We got Discerning Veteran. We got Surprise Strike from Rogue One. Cloud Rider. Underworld Thug, just a really base card. Bravado, if you've defeated an enemy unit in this case. Cement costs two less to ready a unit. That seems solid, actually. Eh, I might be slow again, I'm not sure. Enticing the Reward. Uncommon. Freetown Backup. Finally, another rare. Two sides. Come on, give us something good. We got a Wookiee Warrior. I mean, I do love this artwork, though. That looks really cool. I would love the hyperspace version of this character. But we're not hunting for that today. I don't even know what we're hunting for anymore at this point other than the showcases. I'm pretty excited about that Kylo's TIE Silencer card. <laughs> we got Fennec Shand right there. Maz Katana's Castle. We got Detention Block Rescue, <laughs> Chewy, and uh, War Zone Lieutenant, v uh, Vigilant Pursuit Craft, Trandoshan Hunters, Cargo Juggernaut, Clone Deserter. Oh, yeah, we finally see our boy again. We got Rokai Gunship uh, for a hyperspace car. That one looks pretty cool, I guess. We got Kenton Intimidator. We're getting a lot of really nice hyperspace cards, to be honest, or at least a lot in quantity. I feel like Concord, Dawn, Interceptors. Of course, there probably is a high chance of us getting normal ones. We got Dangar as our uncommon. And an ooh, an actual hyperspace Dangar right behind him. Okay, we'll take that. that. This one looks so much cooler, in my opinion. I love seeing the whole desert in the background. We got more Flamethrower as our rare. And Bravado as our next one. Okay, I gotta organize some of these. Okay, now we are a little bit more organized in the background. It really gets out of control fast, or I just really suck at organizing. Anyways, we got Jabba the Hutt starting up next as a nice little car. We got Space Mines. We've seen... Wow, actually, now that I'm looking at that art design, looks very, very... Uh, Should have been a little bit more detail, I think. Disabling Fang Fighter. Price on your head. Village Protectors. Reckless Gunslinger, uh, Rickety Quad Jumper, WK Pirate Gang, Gray Squadron Y Wing, Smuggler Starfighter, Twin Pod Cloud Car, Lady Proxima, L3, Revenant Reserves, and Finalizer as a legendary card. Overwhelm, when played, choose any number of our friendly units. Each of these units captures an enemy non leader unit in the, the same area. Wow, that's that's good i think right that's i mean that's that's very powerful house cast soldier as our that looks like bo -Katan. but i think that's just a random mando oh yeah it definitely is a random man i see those markings on her helmet that's really sick though i like that artwork i love seeing uh little new characters like that okay moving on with our next pack now we're starting to go down to the final little bit we got gar saxon remnant science facility Oh yeah, more music. Heroic Renegade. Now I'm being quiet in respect to him. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay. Desperate Attack. Hawk. <laughs> Black Sunstar. I thought of the meme right there. Principal. Outlaw. Uh, Frontier Trader. Smuggler's Aid. Fell the Dragon. IG-11. Nice to see IG here. Some Taika Waititi. Zuckus. And Craig and Gore. Wow. I didn't know he was in here. Uh, rare right there. And Triple Dark Raid. Uh, this is, card looks really good, actually, like visually. And just as like, this doesn't even look like it's from the same set. It just looks so different design. It's so dark. But a war going on and uh, so much words right there. So interesting to see some designs. When I first got into Hearthstone, I actually watched 
this uh, Twitch streamer named Raynad. Now he's coming up with his own game, but it's always fun to see his little insights on like card details and because he's creating his own game called like the uh, what's it called? Um, the berserk? Not the berserk. What am I thinking? It's uh, tr the bizarre. The bizarre. And I don't know. I like sitting, hearing his thoughts on time, checking in how that game is going. We got. Oh, I put him in the wrong spot. And um, anyways, the uh, reputable hunter. Let's just continue on with some of these cards. Common wanted insurgents, outlaw, Corona, Anima outpost, antagonizer, rich reward. A nice shot of man, the Mandalorian right there. Put that there. Chain code collector. I like. Oh, he's behind a wall. For a sec, I thought the card was like split in half artwork-wise. We got Hunter of the Haxian Brood. And a Street Gang Recruiter. Uh, Heavy Fire. Sonara Son. That was an uncommon as well. Ooh, nice. We got a rare Hyperspace Enterprising Lackeys. I like the artwork on that. Makes it, the hallway look pretty solid. Ooh, we got another rare right here. And it is Bazine Natal. I don't know this character. Oh my gosh. I am going to have to look her up for sure. Underworld looks like... Is that Tattoo? That's not Tattooing. It's some... Well, I'm, I'm looking up this character for sure after this. I have no idea who that is. That is so cool. Oh my gosh. And we got a Ma after all this. We got to get like a refractor of that character for sure. <laughs> We've pulled so many different Ma's. I mean, we can build a deck around now at this point. We got Han Solo as our leader card. Navarro City. Out, Outland tie Vanguard, Desperate Attack, Outflank, Black Sun Starfighter. Definitely my favorite ship out of the set artwork, or just choice wise. I don't know. That's such a sick one. Uh, ooh, the Patrol Wing Hyperspace. I love the sky in this shot for sure. That is a nice one. Nice little hyperspace pull right there. And we have, and uh, Smuggler's Aid as our next card. Chain Code Collector, seeing that twice in a row now. Bo-Katan, Frozen in Carbonite, Envy's Nest Hyperspace. That's what I'm talking about. That's one that I definitely would like to see. That looks great. That card looks fantastic. I love her. Oh, nice. That was a good one. Stolen a Land Speeder as our rare. And Poe Dameron, Foil, Legendary Card. Okay. We will definitely be putting him aside. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. Again, so dark. I wish I could see more details on his face a little bit better. But this is just... Oh, love to get those legendary foil cards. I mean, that this pack feels heavy. I'm not kidding. I'm feeling lucky in this one specifically. We're going to be careful now. I have no idea why. All right. Actually, you know what? I think I saw a black border. We got Bosk right there. Death Watch Hideout. Another Nima Outpost. Hey, we got the Patrol Wing. The Antagonizer, Timely Intervention, Gentle oh, Giant, oh my gosh, that is such a sweet card. I love that. Heal damage, too, that just uh, makes sense. Rivals, we got Hunter of Haxian, Street Gang Recruit, that's sad, too. That, oh my gosh, when you think of that, he's recruiting a kid, pri Privateer Crew. Was that a kid? I'm not even sure. It is a kid, oh my gosh. Okay, we got, hey, we got Rose Tico. Ah, that's cool to see in her. I would love a uh, legendary or hyperspace of her. Cripple Authority. Right there. Nice artwork. I like that. Kira. Hey, as our rare. Oh my gosh. I would have loved to see her as well. But we got Privateer Seek. Oh my gosh. This artwork actually looks so good with this card, I think. Something about all of it being like black. This looks like a. They're in. I don't know. I like that's a nice space shot. That's my thoughts on that one. I like, I kind of like that card actually. We're getting so many. Oh my, so many great uh, shifts in this set. Hondo right there. I mean, I would expect nothing less from the bounty hunters of Star Wars to have. Oh wait, that was a hyperspace card actually. Nice. That's pretty neat. We got public enemy as our common card. Reputable hunter. House cast soldiers, outlaw cross. Sorry guys, I feel like I'm also being just a little bit like almost like nervous on this one. I don't know why. Uh, we got resourceful pursuers as our hyperspace card, criminal muscle. Just been a long time since I've done one of these to be honest. No bargain, and it's just so hot lately. I'm just I'm even sweating a little bit to be honest. We got bounty uh, posting as our. Un you hear that? Oh my gosh, it sounds incredible. 
uncommon there we got fen we got imprisoned it's never been this loud before i think imprisoned as our rare and we got hey we got an embo foil there that looks really good actually i actually just realized that some of that sound was coming from right behind me from the tv oh my gosh okay let's get our head in the game that looked like a foil hyperspace oh my gosh it actually looks like we might have got something insane okay we got to fix this real quick we want to see these cards up close we got lando as our rare action donald Glo uh, glover 2 pretty nice one right there remnant science facility i would love to see that one as a hyperspace card Another Desperado Free Fighter. So many of these. A Tree Tender. Okay, I'm not going to try with that one right now. We got Warbird Stowaway. Okay, I just need to hurry up to this last card. This last card is looking good, guys. Covert Strength. Make sure you guys can read some of these. We got Rich Reward. What we do to get the hyperspace of that one? Relentless Pursuit. Res Resourceful Pursuers. Guild Target. Millennium Falcon. Hey, I didn't know that Millennium Falcon was in this. They're probably going to print so many different Millennium Falcons. Enforced Loyalty. Our rare Palpatine's return. What's our... That looks shiny on another level. Am I nervous? Oh my... And it's... Okay. You know what? I'm not going to lie right there. I was pretty... I was pretty hyped. But we did end up getting Moisture Farmer. Restore 2. <laughs> oh man. Okay. You fooled me on this. This is just such a, I mean, this card, something about it. It doesn't even look like the hyperspace rings are really around it. Like, you, they are there, but this card looks shiny like none other. This is the shiniest card on the table for sure. We're going to put that one up to the side right there. And now we're going to open up our last two packs. Oh, my gosh. this uh, But like I said, we got another box coming, so we have another chance. At, I also have a um, uh, Sparks of Rebellion box as well, actually. So we got lots more. We got a lot more on Lemonade. We're going to go so hard when that new set comes out with, with Ahsoka for sure. We got Huts. Oh my gosh, we got something else shiny in this one. Okay, let's just go to a Pillage. We got, because a lot of these cards are just getting modded. Coer. Oh, wait, did we see that one? Maybe we did. Death Watch, Loyalist, Collector, Starhopper, Bounties, Guild, Initiate, Privateer, Seek, Slaver's Freighter, Toro, Calican as our Uncommon. That's a really nice one. That's the same Gunslinger episode, right? Um, uh, tr tr brutal traditions. Croissantin. Okay, Croissantin. Let's. See. I see you there. Okay, it's an uncommon hyperspace card. So actually, now, yeah, I got a little spoiled right there. Give it to your anger rare. And oh, it's Echo though. Okay. I mean, come on, Echo. Anyone from the Bad Batch? I think that's actually an insane pull right there. That's really good. We got one last pack right here so let's open it up let's get lucky oh god okay last pack can we do it and we're starting off with a hyperspace han solo 2 not too shabby not too shabby and we'll put you over there we got remote village we got clan ren rescuer as our common death mark who shot first and her rivals fall. I don't know if you guys have seen Harrison Ford's answer. He says, I don't care. <laughs> I'm not even caring. Daring Raid, Moment of Glory, Wookiee War. Hey, there's the comment of the yeah, I love that artwork. We got we gotta get the hyperspace version of that. Fugitive Wookiee. Mandalorian Warrior. Jetpack. Oh, that's an uncommon card right there. The armor. Nice to see some Emily Swallow. If you ever meet her in person, I swear you will love her more than any other character. Cassian Andor. Uncommon. We got rare Zori Bliss. Let's go. That was a sick one. We got and then a rare discerning veteran. Okay, that is our opening. Let's check out everything all together. And here is a look at everything that we got. We're gonna take a look at all of our hyperspace and our different foil cards. I just put them in two different stacks so you can see the height. We got quite a bit, to be honest. We got some dope cards right there, but let's take a look. 24 packs. You get a whole bunch of comments. I mean, come on. If you buy a booster box, you can definitely probably make some pretty interesting decks. And then we got our uncommon stack right here. Pretty good size as well. Going to our rares next to that. A little bit of a thinner. And all of our bases. What it should, it should be the 24 bases and 24 liters generally. Except some of them were our hyperspace cards and whatnot. 
But let's take a look at some of our giant pulls in this. We got four legendaries on the top, starting with this Kylo Ren. Absolutely love that legendary so much. Next up, we got Evacuate. We also got the Finalizer and Poe Dameron. What a great legendary card. I love that one so much. And then next up, oh yeah, this was foil though. Okay, so that, this is a foil Poe Dameron legendary. So that's even better than just a normal legendary. These three are just normal legendaries though. But then taking a look at some of our hyperspace foils that we pulled, some of our big hitters. We got Echo right there. What a great one. We got Moisture Farmer, Daring Raid, and Kylo's TIE Silencer which on top is also a legendary card. So honestly, that pull is just absolutely, you can't even really see the shine from this angle, but this card is gorgeous. Probably my favorite pull out of this box. Like I said, we got another one coming, but let's take a look at some of our actual hyperspace and foil cards. And when it comes to our foils, we got some pretty solid ones, but not like any incredible, incredible rares. Starting off, I mean, we got two, four, six eight ten and twelve different common foils and we got one two three four five uncommon ones i'm pretty happy with some of these uncommon ones especially that cassian andor i like that one a lot actually this four ldm as well that's nice i like i like both of those and then we ended up getting two rare ones with the triple dark raid being one of my favorite visual cards of this set i mean this looks like some advanced magic the gathering card something i don't even know and then we also got pre vizsla pretty awesome one as well and then you, you could technically count our poe dameron up there but come on that's going to be with the legendary crew that's such a nice one overall i mean i like the artwork i think these cards still look a little dark i had to add some light to be able to see the shine effect and really turn up the iso to make these cards kind of like actually seeable but yeah let's take a look at some of the hyperspace cards and here's a look at all of our hyperspace cards i'm actually a really big fan of them especially some of these leaders that we'll take a look at in a second but starting off we got three up here two four six common so let's see nine commons total for hyperspace cards four uncommon ones and some of the uncommons are really good you get a lot of characters in uncommons and rares so it's really nice to fun uh, pull some of those as well we ended up getting two different just normal rare hyperspace cards three bases and four leader cards with i gotta be honest uh let's see i this dr afra oh yeah all three of these are comments and then the dr afra is actually a rare i think the dr afra is actually probably my favorite to be honest i like that one a lot but yeah, that pretty much does sum up everything that we pulled from today's unboxing. Like I said, we do still have one more Shadows of the Galaxy box. We got a Sparks of Rebellion box, and we are going to go so hard later this year when the Ahsoka leader comes out. I am pulling that one for a fact. You're going to see it here. So definitely stay tuned for that. Check out my most recent Star Wars Unlimited boxing. And yeah, other than that, I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.